Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Redmi A3. For that you don't need to download an extra app for because you have already pre-installed a file explorer. Let me show you how you can use it. So just swipe up like this so that we have uh, access here um, to the app drawer and now check out for the app named Files. Here it is. Okay, just tap on it. And for the very first time, you need to give a permission, not just tap on continue and then allow access to manage all files. No? Tap here. Okay. So then we are in the File Explorer and first of all, we have all organized in categories uh, like downloads, images, audios, videos and so on. But we need the lower part here, the storage devices no? and here especially the internal storage. Okay, let's tap on the internal storage. And we will see now here all the folders which one contains data we are able to transfer. Okay, I recommend to you to start with the photos and videos you have done with your camera because this kind of data is taking a lot of storage. So you will find them here in the, at the DCAM folder and then at the camera folder. And here they are, all the photos and videos you have done with your camera. Now go on one of these files, which one you want to transfer and long press it. Then it's marked no? and now mark, you can mark other ones or if you want to have all then you can just go on the three points and go on select all and then they're all selected. Okay then you have two opportunities you can uh, copy them no, for the safety or you can move them what's better if you need more storage here on your internal storage. For that just go on three points you can copy them and I recommend to you to move to uh, to go on move to because um, yeah, with that you have more space than on your internal storage. And now you can choose the place where you want to have it. No? So we tap on SD card. And now we are on our SD card. And as you can see, I have uh, created already many folders because it's much better for the overview. If not, you mix up all your data, uh, all your files, and it's not that good if uh, you, as you will lose completely the overview. No? If the music is next to the pictures directly and yeah, you know what I mean. So I recommend to you to add folders here and you can do it here on top, add new folder. And yeah, I've created already some folders as you see uh, and I've also a DCM folder, but you can name it also different like photos or videos or something like this. Huh? Then yeah, let me go to camera as well. Okay, and if you're in the folder you want to have your data in, just go here on move here. Okay, and then the phone is transferring the files directly to the SD card. And yeah, this is taking um, a few seconds. If you have a lot of data, maybe a thousand of files, then just lay down your phone and yeah, drink a coffee or something like this. No? Okay, we are soon finished here. And then I will show you another trick you can do to transfer things. We are soon finished. Okay, we are finished. Okay, now all the data have transferred to the SD card. Okay, let me show you something else for that. Let me go back here to the internal storage. Now, so I'm in the internal storage here now. And the same thing as we have done, uh, we have done with files, I'm sorry. Uh, we can do it also with folders. No? So if you want to transfer a complete folder, it is possible. So then just go here on the three points at the end of the name. And now you can copy it or move it also. Uh, can you see that? You can go also here on move to, and now you will transfer the complete folder directly to the SD card if you choose it. Uh? So pretty, pretty nice. But let me show you something else also. Um, let's go on the camera for that. So then let's go here on the arrow. Now we have the chance to have a setting icon, tap on it. And if we scroll down a bit that list, we have the part here, save to SD card. And if you enable this feature, that means that all your future photos and videos you, you, will, you will do with your camera are going directly to the SD card. And this is saving a lot of time because you don't have to transfer them huh? all the time. Yeah, I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something up. That would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for. Yeah, I've created also some other videos if you're interested in with some more tips and tricks and so on. You can also subscribe me if you haven't done it before. Thank you so, so much for your support and yeah, maybe until next time. <laughs> Ciao.